Really quick one today, I'm going to show you guys how to make your own shelf in Maya. The shelves are um, these little tabs at the very top of your viewport. There are ones that Maya comes with, such as rigging or animation. Then there are ones for plugins like Advanced Skeleton or Substance. But um, you might want your own one because it's a quick way to get access to tools that you use all the time. So how do you make your own shelf? Well, let's go over here to this little gear on the, sh the left part of the shelf tab. You're gonna go to new shelf, easy as pie, and then I'm just gonna call this YouTube. And now you'll have a blank shelf here and you'll find it up here. If you have a lot of tabs like I do, uh, you'll have to navigate using the arrows. But once you have that one available, you can start adding tools. So what tools do I use all the time? Um, I use, uh, I use freeze transformations. So if I hold down uh, control and shift and then select freeze transformations, it'll show up on my shelf. So you just use that uh, shortcut on your keyboard and you can get anything on your shelf. So freeze transformations. Um, I also use center pivot a lot. I also use, um, very importantly, delete by type history. That's a big one. Um, I also like certain uh, polygon primitives. So sphere, cube, cylinder, those are all good to have up there and so forth and so on. You can add as much as you like. Um, I think uh, insert edge loops a good one. So control shift and then edit mesh. There's a bridge, bevel. These are ones I use all the time. So once you've got uh, your shelf going, you can continue to add to it as you find things that you use. And it's just an easy way instead of having to go up here to get tools that you might want. So once I click cube, I've got my cube. Click sphere. There you go. And um, it's easy as that. So uh, definitely build your own shelves and customize them just to how you like them. Super helpful.